New at 6, 13 News Now is looking for ways to give back to the community. And what better way than to give to nonprofits already offering so much to Hampton Roads? Yeah, one of them is called In Jewel, where leaders and volunteers work to end human trafficking. With a little help from our parent company, Tegna, and Sparaco surprised the organization's founder with a boost. It is definitely in our backyard. Some things in the community can often go unnoticed. You know, we use the phrase hidden in plain sight. And the efforts to help people in these situations can also fly under the radar. <laughs> Naomi Astar is founded in Jewel in 2007. She works day in and day out trying to find safe spaces and donations for children, teens and adults who are vulnerable to human trafficking. Probably September time frame that we started getting more of a flux of calls. Kids are back in school. During the holidays, you got a lot more anxiety, uh, hopelessness. Uh, helplessness. But as Stara says, bringing an issue happening right under our noses into plain view of the community requires a lot of help, both physically and financially. Actually, we always try to get Tegna Foundation to help us out too. So if you have a pull on that. <laughs> and speaking of hidden in plain sight, Tegna Foundation is our parent company. Yes. And we wanted to give you something that's been sitting on my lap oh my this goodness. whole time. It is a check for $6,500 oh to gosh. give you guys a little boost around this time of year. Thank you so much. You're not supposed to get us to cry, <laughs> but I am blessed and our community is blessed and it will definitely help a lot of survivors. Thank you, Tegna. We're boarding in Virginia Beach. I'm Ann Sparocco for 13 News Now. The star says she plans to use that money for a series of events in January to help raise awareness. January is Human Trafficking Prevention Month.